hi guys welcome back to the channel this is the real soul channel we talk about sneakers budgeting and sneakers vlog do show reviews and many more so i won't take much of your time so on today's review i just want to share you a nice hunt so i went on a real soul hunting today and i got this nike shoe below 46 dollars and stick with me i'm gonna unbox and unpack everything how i got it you know tips and advice for you guys to be able to cop something like this my own experience with you know saving and budgeting on sneakers in total so let's get into it so guys i'm gonna be holding the camera while showing you the shoe so let me take the shoe out i got this from a nike outlet so the steel as you can see here's the shoe as you can see do you notice the lead of the box is missing that shows it, it was on clearance anytime you see a missing lead like this they intentionally do it like nike employees intentionally take it out just to identify is is on clearance so this shoe was 110 110 usd and i got it on clearance which was on sale I got it for as you can see $49.99 that was like $50 and I didn't know what year this shoe was released but when I saw it this shoe literally reminded me of this Peradon this 2 c collab you know it has that type of asshole and that type of you know silhouette the structure let me know am I tripping about that let me know but that's what I think let me know what you think and the details like this 3M, I love this 3M so much. It reflects in the night. And the lace is white. Here's the swoosh red. The, it has a mesh. It has a mesh material. The toolbox is like a synthetic leather. And the house, normal also, it has like rubber here with the air units and everything. You know. There's one thing I want to share. I didn't actually pay $49.99 for this. I am a Nike member. So for you to become a Nike member, you have to download the app and you become a member. So due to that, I was able to use my 15% reward on this, which make the total amount to be 45 and four cents. So a shoe that was sold for 110, I got it for 45 and 4 cents. So I, that, was the top, that was the type of tips I want to be sharing. People learn stuff all the time and that's what actually YouTube is meant for, to learn stuff, you know, to know about stuff. So if you're a Nike member, you have up to 90 days to actually return a shoe. Like if you got a shoe, and you see it in the end and you don't really like it you have up to 90 days to return it if you're a member but if, if you are not a member you only got 30 days so that way if you return it to the nike outlet then they put it on clearance as they put this on clearance so i'm speaking for only people that are in the america like usa i don't know how it works in europe i don't know how it works in africa i don't know how it works in anywhere else but here in the united states if you are a member and you have a Nike account, you have 90 days time to return any shoe you don't really like. Be in the same condition you got it. If you wear it, they won't, they won't give you back your money. But if you are not a Nike member, you only got 30 days. So guys, that's what I want to share. What do you think? Is this a good cop? Or are you not copying? Because I was like, people are so stalking in the hype and reselling and all that i mean if you're reselling it's a good thing because you're making money right but at the same time there are people that actually want to wear shoes get performance of shoes you know so i was like let me share this for anybody out there that's trying to get a shoe under 46 dollars and i hope i did a good work and if you haven't subscribed yet please do it helps the algorithm join the russo family you are welcome on board we are at i think 690 subscribers i post what's it called i post 
short videos i post sneaker related content you know for you to enjoy for you to you know skip through feel free to check the shot and i'll be bringing more of this i like to do more of this i just don't want to be sitting talking to you over the camera i want to show you the exact product that i'm doing right now see the receipt is there and everything and one more thing once you go to the nike outlet you cannot return the shoe any shoe on clearance you cannot return it the sales are final so you have to think twice before getting it because any any purchases you make is a final purchase so that's it about that i have a shoe that i'm considering to return but i don't know yet i think i got it right here as you see i'm considering to return that shoe but i'll be doing an, a review before i return it because i got it and I, I was like i don't really like this shoe because i got this already but when i re when i review it you're gonna know what's inside you know you're gonna know what's inside so guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you do like i said please don't forget to subscribe it helps the algorithm and don't forget to check out the shots and any other content that we've done don't forget to check the unboxing and the review i did on the main speradon stussy nike and mag zoom and um like i said i'm gonna be unboxing a shoe next so stay tuned for that and i hope you enjoyed this video always remember love all it none and i'll be out here spreading love for all and hf for none safe peace see you on the next video